I'm Dr. Julie Schell from Bow Bottom Veterinary Hospital and today we're going to show you how to brush a cat's teeth. And so Luke here doesn't mind at all the taste of the toothpaste. It's good to kind of let him lick it off of your fingers or at least smell it. And it has a nice chicken aroma. It also comes in a vanilla mint flavor. And so just so that he gets used to kind of the, the flavor of it. Um, the first step in kind of touching the cat is to wrap a half of a Kleenex around your finger. So you take a Kleenex and rip it in half and wrap it around your finger. Kleenex is pretty abrasive so you can get quite a bit of plaque off just with that. Then you kind of take his mouth and pet him. What I'm doing though is petting him on the inside of his mouth. So I'm not just petting the lips and the cheeks, I'm petting the inside of the mouth. And so you can see that lots of plaque and bacteria and sometimes even bleeding like gingivitis can come off. The more you brush the cat's teeth, the less gingivitis develops. It's of course important to check with your veterinarian to make sure he doesn't need a proper thorough dental cleaning. We just did Luke's cleaning last, a few months ago, so we want to kind of maintain it with proper home care. And so doing uh, home care toothbrushing is very important. Luke could get away with actually another dental cleaning soon. So you just wrap an, another Kleenex, a fresh, the fresh half, around your finger and just kind of massage the inside of his mouth. So you're actually literally petting him on the inside and cats don't mind that at all. They kind of like that feeling. And you just kind of get them used to having something touching their mouth. <laughs> Good boy, Luke. And then you can use a nice little kitty cat toothbrush and put the tiniest amount of the toothpaste on, the brushes you can and do the same thing. You're kind of opening up his mouth a little bit and just kind of um, massaging the inside of the teeth. Good boy, Luke. And some cats will actually lick it right off of the tooth brush and then you can encourage them by um, doing that again where you just kind of put some of the toothpaste on the brush and letting him kind of lick it off. And then you can get like a massage action around and around or you can go back and forth. And it's good to just get the outside of the teeth. You don't have to open the cat's mouth and get the inside. It's mostly getting the outside of the cat's teeth. And same thing on this side. If you're right or left-handed, you can change hands. Just kind of mush, brush and massage. And it's all about how much the cat can tolerate. And since Luke hasn't had his toothbrush ever before for a very long time, um, it's good to start slow and then work your way up. And so every day, do a, a little bit of work with them, and always it should be a positive experience. You can feed them little cat treats that are healthy, like veterinary recommended cat treats, or um, you can also feed bits of the proper prescription diet food that helps break down bacteria as they chew. And that's really good for long-term um, maintenance of, of health as well for their teeth. And there are definitely other types of chews and even toys that a cat can chew that will help clean their teeth. So if you have any questions, please give us a call or definitely talk to your regular veterinarian. But our number is 403-278-1984 and our website is www.bowbottomvet.com. Thank you very much. Good boy, Luke.